Hello guys, in this video I want to talk about a really cool lens, this company, this is Zeroe. They've previously released a, a really good lens, which is this one. It was a 50mm f1.8 and it was the first ever on the market affordable true anamorphic lens. Well now they followed up uh, their successful lens with this baby, it's the 35mm, also f1.8. And if you're wondering how does it compare to the, the 50 millimeter, the previous version, uh, it is just as good, if maybe not even better. <laughs> I would say maybe even slightly better than the 50 millimeter version, even though this was already really good. Uh, what I mean by that is that the flares are there if you really point it, at, you know, like a really strong light source, uh, but they're a little bit uh, kind of, I would say, more organic looking. And especially when you have the lens, uh, you know, off to the side a little bit from the main light source, and you just have the kind of the, the light kind of hitting the, the front of the lens at an angle, you're gonna get these nice little glows and uh, these kind of blooming effects uh, within this lens. So. Uh, Personally, I think it looks really nice, looks very cinematic, very organic. And again, if you're gonna compare this to any other standard anamorphic lens on the market, these lenses are tiny. So really, if you wanna get into anamorphics, you're not gonna find anything else out there that's this small and in this light. Now, actually, this whole video you're watching right now is also shot on the 35 millimeter f1.8 anamorphic lens from Zeroe, and that's because I have it mounted there uh, on my packet 4k camera and that one of course is a micro four thirds uh, version this one is an e-mount version but again doesn't matter which version you pick they're identical and the way that they're built the only difference is on the back uh, obviously the mount so in short the 35 millimeter lens from zero e just as their previous 50 millimeter lens i think are a great way to get into anamorphics if you're interested in that kind of stuff this lens is nice and sharp again the same as the 50 millimeter version uh, which is something that's very hard to find on the most anamorphic lenses it creates a nice clean image uh, even though at the same time it also gives you slightly more organic looking flares and also flares that i think are a little bit more subtle uh, than maybe the 50 millimeter version and overall i love shooting with this lens so if you're wondering if you should grab this one maybe you already own the 50 millimeter version and you like it well you're gonna love this one now if you haven't actually tried any of the lenses from Zeroe then definitely give this one or the 50 millimeter version a try uh, and you will not be disappointed especially uh,